Recording. There you go. There you go. Okay. So today for arts and crafts, and hold on. I'm gonna be making these little, little turkey bookmarks. But it's this this little turkey out of construction paper. So since Thanksgiving's the next holiday, that's what we're doing. <laughs> All right. Okay, so the construction paper. Bunch of different colors. I have blue, green, yellow, red, and yellow. Um, I have a sharpie. I have scissors and a glue stick here. And my glue stick. Um, I am using for the little for the body of the um, turkey. I'm using a paper bag because it's thicker. I don't know, the lady in the video used um, a paper bag. So just to make it more sturdy, I guess. All right, so here we go. You guys don't you can see what I'm doing. Okay, so first we're gonna do the red part of the turkey. Our red piece of paper, and I'm gonna fold it in half, and then we're only gonna use half of this. So I'm gonna fold it in half and cut it. I'm gonna cut it along our line right here. And I look like this. this is our half piece and then um, since we want it to be a square we're gonna connect our corners so this corner is gonna come down and then we're gonna cut off this extra piece right here Okay, like that. So we're going to have like a little triangle that's folded in half. We're going to keep it folded in half. And then from here, we're going to have our flat side towards us. And we're going to take our corner and we're going to. We're gonna take our corner and then we're gonna bring it up to the top. And we're gonna to do that on both sides. We have that one. And the same thing with this corner, we're gonna bring it up to the top. So it's gonna look like this. And then we're gonna open it back up. And then the front flap, I'm going to be bending it down to the bottom. And fold that. And we're going to take this and fold it back up. And then we're going to we're going to fold it down into like a little pocket. And same thing to the other side. Huh? Yes. I'm making a bookmark like this right here. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna be folding this side in as well. 
like the other side. So both sides are gonna be folded in like that. That's gonna have a little pocket. And then we're gonna take this one and fold it in the same way. I can get it in there. We're gonna have a little flat back, but it has the pocket. And this is where like the where the book the pages are gonna go into. This is the start of it. Okay. Um next we're gonna do the body of the turkey, which is the brown pieces. And I'm gonna take my my paper bag. I'm gonna cut another square. I have a paper bag. She used, um, she said you could use two pieces of brown paper or put a brown paper on top of a white paper. So you're basically gluing two pieces together, but I figured these are, paper bags are pretty thick. So. And it's the same color. Okay, so we're gonna take our little strip right here and we're gonna fold it in half because I'm gonna need two circles out of it. And they're not perfect circles. They're like oval circles. <laughs> Something like that. We got two. And we're going to take our glue stick. We're going to glue the body on. I'll put a bunch of glue on and push that on there. And then our second one, we're gonna put it about right there. So we only need glue like along the bottom. <laughs> okay, so that is our body. And now let's see. We're going to do the the beat. And we're gonna make it yellow. So you don't need a lot of paper for this one. I just cut like a little tiny triangle in the corner. I'm just gonna cut a triangle. Try to do it. Like that. Yeah. Okay, and then we're gonna get a red piece of paper because we want to get the little. I don't know what this thing's called. I want to say it's called a good thing, but the red little dangly thing on turkey. So we're gonna glue the beak onto here because we're just gonna outline the the red dangly thing. Or just gotta cut it out anyway. Um, so with that, I'm gonna use my pen and just kind of outline it so it's gonna look like that. And I'm just gonna cut it out.
Um, it's a turkey bookmark. It's a turkey bookmark. I just lost. Okay. Try my best here. Okay, there we go. So like that, little tiny thing. And then we're just gonna go ahead and glue that onto our turkey. So we have his beak. And let's see, next we're supposed to do the eyes. I think I'm just going to use my pen. I used a Sharpie last time and it didn't come out. Good. So with the eyes, you're just going to, we're going to kind of draw them in here. I thought maybe the googly eyes would work, but um, I don't think it's supposed to have anything raised. I don't know. She did it this way, so that's how I'm going to do it. So we have one eye and another eye. Okay, we got eyeballs. And then she did do some like pink cheeks, but I think I'm gonna do orange. I don't have it on mine, but I'm gonna add it on now. So these are like tiny little circles. Let's see if I can even cut them. Okay, so maybe I'll draw them first. And it'll come out easier, better. She had little on these like like rosy cheeks, I guess, but or is it gonna be orange? Okay, these are really tiny. These are like little tiny dots. One cheek and the other one. So it's really tiny. <laughs> kind of looks funny, but it's the face. And then we'll do the feathers. Let's see. So we're going to do yellow blue, green, and orange. Let's cut these. I do two green, so I'm gonna flip one in half. Mm -hmm. 
maybe not so okay i'm gonna cut by the length that i think the feathers would be i think that's about it. okay we have all of our colors here and i'm just gonna cut one and then they'll all just come out because with these bookmarks they have um different kinds of turkeys and they have christmas tree ones and ghost ones they're really cute if you're a reader okay so we have our feathers and let's see We'll do like green on the outside. I think I did it like this before. So I'll start with the green one. No, no, no. What? Okay, so I'm gonna put, so in the pocket, on the back of our turkey, we're gonna put one of our layer feathers inside there. So it comes out looking like that. I don't know if you can see. So there's one feather. And then we'll go to our orange. And put an orange on. That and our yellow. Our yellow and we'll do blue. And last, we have green. Right. That's our turkey. And they did give an idea. There it is. She did make like the end brown. Like that. So it's our turkey, the turkey bookmark. And then um, she did say for the back to write what you're thankful for. So does anybody have a suggestion what I should write on the back? Or give me something you're thankful for? Anybody? Amanda, what are you thankful for? I'm thankful for my mom, my family. Your mom and your family? And the dog. <laughs> okay, so we'll write, um, we'll do family. Thankful for my baby too. Family and mom. I'm thankful for good health. For good health. All right, anybody else got one? Anybody? Zeke, what are you thankful for? I'm a 
Desiree, what are you thankful for? Andy said he's thankful for the turkey season. <laughs> for the what? Turkey season? Yeah, Andy said he's thankful for the turkey season. <laughs> okay, that's a good one. So am I. <laughs> you heard Vanessa? She said she is too. Turkey. For the rain. For the rain. Rocio said the rain. I'm so excited for the rain. For leggings and boots. <laughs> Leggings and boots and sweaters. Hoodies and sweaters. There you go. <laughs> I'm thankful for the garage door. Sweaters and hoodies. Okay. That's it. It's a little tricky here. I'll put it on the book so you guys can see. I'm thankful for you, Vanessa. You're thankful for me? Oh, I'm thankful for you, for you too, Amanda. I'm thankful for the book fine too. All right, that's our bookmark. That, that is really cute. Good job, Vanessa. That's so cute. <laughs> I like her. I like her. I like her. Grandma? What? Emma. E A M A. Emma? Yeah.